Hey, hey guys, welcome back. What's up? Welcome back. So we just finished doing the thing, uh, got it, the getting the, the three, the thing, the thing, the temple back. of sacred ashes. There's a decision coming up, and I don't know what to do for it. You don't? No. And I know all of my decisions mostly, but what I don't decision know is it? You tell the guy, right? There's the guy at the very end, like him, that is like here with you, in yes. the very front thing. And you yes. have to tell him, but he wants to tell everybody about the Urn of Sacred Ashes. And he wants right. everyone to come here. But what do you do? Because, like, one of the options is to maybe not alive him. <laughs> um, well, one of the... I honestly, I think I did that. It was, it, I think it's bro, the Jenna TV or whatever his name is. Yeah, Brother Jenna TV. Yeah, he's the one who wants to do that. Spoilers. Yeah, um, yeah I but totally I don't, forgot about that till right now. I don't believe that it should be accessed by everybody. Because like, then people are just going to take it. They might not pass the trial, but I don't know if it's like since I opened the way for the trial, that it's now potentially like you can just like go through it. You know what I mean? Like, I don't know if like, um, I... Hmm. Great. Sorry, Colgrim. Yeah, I killed him. Um, have you ever chosen to let him live? No. I say let him live. I don't want to, though. Because neither of us have ever done it. Okay. But I know Liliana's... Oh, that's a, that's a massive... I know Liliana will get mad if you let him live. Oh. Because you're literally... Like, if he tells everybody about the Urn of Sacred Ashes, everyone yeah. will come here. Right? And, like, try and take a pinch of it. Oh, I don't know if that's actually then would make her hostile. Because I know destroying the ashes makes her hostile. Yeah. But. Oh, yeah. I'm so torn yeah. about this because I don't know what the fuck to do. Like, I'm usually like straight on decision, but I'm murdering somebody. Sorry about potentially bumping the mic there. Because I'm murdering somebody, but at the same time. It's to protect the, like, fucking these ashes from getting desecrated or from, like, people kind, you know what I mean? Because if he tells everybody, and they all fucking come here, right? Mm -hmm. They're going to take advantage of it. Because it can save somebody's life, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. like, like, we're able to prevent a death with this. But why, but who, oh why, God, do, why do we seem fit to, like, make one person live? You know what mm -hmm. I mean? Like, why should we be the deciding factor? Because mm -hmm. I'm the fucking Grey Warden. But in generally, like, I don't know if I should take away his life to save other people from taking away lives. You know what I mean? Yeah. And who say the masses aren't as welcome as a king to be using it? I think I went the wrong way. By this cultist mage in this room of eggs, I did. Can I take one of these? Dude, do you know um, how much fucking good breakfast I could make out of this? Oh, man. Those are so many eggers. Yeah, right. Or eggies. Bacon and eggies. I only need one like egg to make a good bacon and eggies. Oh, that that would make so much egg. That eggies. Make, that'd make so much eggies. Could you imagine trying to flip that if you wanted to try to like <laughs> if you wanted one just like uh like one medium egg? You know what I mean? If you wanted sunny side up, that'd be easy as shit. But uh, could you punch the pan that you needed to that fuck? <laughs> Damn, that'd be a big ass pan. Yes, yes, it would be. I think they make. So I, I think they make like human sized pans that big. I know I don't have a stove top big enough for that pan or that like ability to make that big egg. Yeah, I also fucking love eggs. I don't know. I think we already I, talked about that, but I love eggs. I fucking love eggs. What's your favorite egg? How do you do your eggs? Um, I'm a huge fan of just straight up scrambled eggs. Um, okay. And also cheesy omelets. Mm, gotcha. Big fan of that. I, I also like uh, sunny side up. Um, some other ways for eggs. Mm -hmm. I'm not a big fan of like hard boiled eggs. Yeah. Anything like that. Never been big on that. Yeah. Oh. What about you? Sunny side up over easy. Sunny side up or over easy. Yeah. And if it's sunny side up, it's very sunny. Like. I want my eggs to fucking run. Yeah, um, yeah, anytime I have them sunny side up, I want them running. Yeah. Because what I like to do with those is usually, um, I, I want to have, like, toast with it. Yeah, one. It's, it's, and all then, with that so, it's all with that sopping of that bread. Exactly. Um, and also I like to put the 
egg on the the bread. Yeah. If I have two pieces, I'll make a sandwich. If not, I'll just break like fold the toast yeah. over into a taco thing. Yeah. Um, um and then dip that into the I remember going to Denny's yolk. once and like so good. Like looking at her and being like, Can I have my eggs over easy? Very easy. And she's like, Okay, over easy. I'm like, no. Very, very easy. easy. I was like, she's like, uh, I was like, very easy? Not. Because I'm, I, I, I'm very, 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 very picky with eggs. Yeah. Like, eggs are the only thing that I'm, like, super picky about. Um, like, because I know most people, they make, like, scrambled eggs or omelets or shit like that. They have, like, cream or milk. I'm not about that life. Don't do it. Mm-hmm. I don't think it adds any flavor to the egg itself. Um, I just add a little pepper and a teensy bit of salt. Yeah, Not I, even the, a fucking pinch, like less than a pinch. Yeah, the only things I uh, add is sometimes salt and pepper. Yeah, that's about it. Moist I never, I never add um, yes. uh, like a bit of milk yeah. to it. I used to do that because like that's how I was taught to make eggs. Yeah, but I just kind of stopped doing that out of pure, purely out of laziness. Um, and now I, I never even buy milk, so. But um, actually, my grandmother used to make um, make them with like butter, yeah. which sounds like a terrible idea, but they're so good. Like, what do you mean, like frying them in butter? No, like um, I think she would she would make. I don't know if she added it after or not, but like she would make this, like those scrambled eggs and yeah. then add like butter or margarine to it, and just mix it in with it. Okay, gave it. A, it, it was really good. Okay, it was the, it's the same effect as. Like, um, frying it in butter? Pretty much, yeah. Um, Which, uh, that's what I do. I don't, that's one okay. of the only things that I wouldn't use oil for. Like, I'll use butter instead for that with, like, eggs and yeah. premium stuff like that. Because, like, one thing that butter does, if you have, like, an edge, if you have any pan with an edge, right? This is mostly visual, but I'll try and make it, like, <laughs> so if you have, like, a pan, at the, oh, I forgot, man. Right <laughs> so if you have, just... like, a pan, right? It's facing this way. And you have those yes. two curved edges. Yes. When butter sits in the bottom of it, those curved edges will start browning anything in it. So if you have, like, a meat of sorts, mm-hmm. and you're browning the meat, it'll brown about halfway because, like, the way that it will fucking work, right? Mm-hmm. So it browns the meat halfway. <clears throat> also, if you're... If you have, like, steak that you do on the... on a frying pan or burgers, mm-hmm. and if you overflip, I hate you. Like, just, <laughs> like... Honestly, like, put a burger in if you have, like, a frying pan full of either, like... I butter or oil, I don't care. Um, I prefer butter myself, but and yeah. then if you, and then you just like let it sit there for like a good like eight to ten minutes on each side, like you know what I mean. Mm-hmm. And then flip, and then don't touch it. Just leave it, leave it there, leave it to cook, leave it to fucking be magical, because um, that's what it will do. It, honestly, like overplaying with the food is like is what like usually turns it bad. Or, it, like, turns out it's not as good as it could be. Like, you need to let it, like, sit and absorb, like, what it's doing. Um, food is very, like, temperamental. I don't play with, like, my eggs at all too much or whatever. Mm-hmm. Um, like, to the point of where I will, like, if I'm cooking, I will go sit down and, like, read. Because I know that I'm not going to, like, flip something until, like, 10, 15 minutes. And I learned that because we had to use the barbecue so much. And to barbecue, it's, uh, oh, here comes the fucking decision. No, it's um, not till the end. Yeah, which is right here. No, you're not at the end yet. Yes, I am. Are you sure? Yes. Have you already been offered by a guy to do something with the I, ashes? I already went to the ashes. But this is the guy right up here. That's him. He'll be oh. right up here. Yeah, this I just wasn't decision. paying attention clearly enough. Um, yeah, there's no major consequence. Just uh, you no. will get disapproval. For killing him by Alistair, Liliana, and Twin. Your entire party. <laughs> you were gone for quite some time. Well, did you find it? What what was it like coming to the was, urn? I mean, um, it was an urn with stuff in it. Oh, the last one's like burnt woman. So much like blasphemy to the chantry. We must organize an expedition. There is so much history here. It must be studied. And and pilgrims should be allowed to come to the urn. But the urn belongs to all the faithful. I agree. We cannot withhold... You have noble intentions, Brother Genitivi. So everyone comes by and takes yeah. the masses. I will spread this good news or die trying. It's inter- interesting that... 
I must return home. I am not a. I hope to see. Okay, he didn't kill him. No. No. The cutscene of killing him is fucking cool, by the way. If you ever want to Google something, your your oh. character's like, okay, and then gets a real mad face and turns and chucks a fucking knife yeah, at him. Yeah, right, right. It's a really cool way to fucking massacre somebody. But wait, now we're... Oh, yeah, I have to go to uh, Redwall. <clears throat> yeah, you know, Castle Redwall. Yeah. Castle Breadwall. Uh, <laughs> come. Also, Castle Bread will not fucking stand for too long. Oh man, do you remember when Tim Hortons used to do those fucking bread bowls? Yes, I do. Oh man, the fucking bread bowls were the best thing ever. I don't know why they fucking stop bread bowls. Oh my god, she detected it wasn't... Of traps. <laughs> oh, sweet. She cannot handle this amount of traps. Yeah. Oh, but why? <coughs> oh, traps are... Fucking shit. No, stop the trap. trap. Trigger my trap card. <laughs> Oh, no, 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 no. I'm pretty sure I've already made that joke. Oh, yeah. All the time, though. Um, yeah. The yu gi oh joke? Yeah. yu gi oh I say that with, uh... Yu -Oh, yu -Oh, yu -Oh. Topaz. Damn it! That's some topaz. <laughs> <laughs> I was just thinking the same thing. <laughs> uh, uh, ooh, I love the name of Faith's Edge and Spellweaver. Like, I know they're, like, pretty, like, typical. <laughs> Wait, no one uses those. Yeah. Fuck that garbage. <clears throat> Uh, Mage's Eye. I do want to keep that one because it's Dragonthorn, right? But, um... Nobody's going to use it. Liliana could. She could, but you're not setting her up to be an archer. Well, maybe I could, then. Maybe you could. Why don't you? Oh, I haven't worn this yet. Oh, cool. Nice. Reflection. Oh, life Drinker. Reflection. Oh, no, 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 I didn't mean to move Life Drinker to the trash. Uh... <laughs> Uh, remove from junk. But these I can destroy them. Ooh, Crush cast them. them into the fire. <laughs> <Isildur. laughs> no one else finds that funny. It's because of how you say it. That's Isildur. the only reason it's funny. Because you add unnecessary amounts of <laughs> R rollings in them. That's because I imagine it's like very over dramatic, you know? It's very like <laughs> it, it's like, oh I'm so sorry. It's very like mm -hmm. You know, like, I'm just, like, motioning my head from my chest. Because I can't fucking find the word, but it's very, like, tense. Again, strong. audio show. Oh, my goodness. Put your phone on, like, I'm, not so I'm vibrate. I'm on the ground. I don't know why people are trying to get a hold of me all of a sudden. Like, I, like throughout the day, like, fucking nothing. Now it's just like, hey, mess up. Hey, mess up. Sure fucking po Mr. Popular over here. Uh, not at all. <laughs> I don't, like, talk to people. Yeah, yeah, that's why you you make a YouTube show where you talk <laughs> to somebody the entire time. I mean, I just talk. I'm not talking at you per se, since I ask you a question, which is you're uh, just kind of talking in the in my yeah. apartment and whether or not I actually. Okay. What up? Hey, you doing? Healing, but nothing works. I found the urn. You oh, just good. Like, oh, good. We can use the ashes on ashes. It would be hilarious. I thought we like, just. You just told me to get the urn. Could you imagine if he's like, I found the urn. And he's like, oh, sweet. And you're like, pocket sand. And they're like, oh, no, that's the urn dust. <laughs> just all over his face. He's like, oh, oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to pocket sand you so hard. That was all, literally all of it. I guess we'll go back. He just like jumps out of bed. I've been healed. Starts holy ghosting. <laughs> Oh yeah, she lives. Where's my boy? He lives. Yeah. So many others. There's much to tell you. Much has happened since you fell ill. Then tell me. Much. Hell yeah. Let's tell you all about it. He looks a lot older than his brother. Oh hell yeah, he does. Still. Do they? Are they doing like some sort of like King Theoden esque thing? Maybe. Perhaps. Or maybe he just went gray real early. His wife looks this young as shit. Trouble. Also, his wife is wearing not a lot of clothes. Done, I love the chicken leg on the end of his shield. What do you mean she's not wearing a lot well, of like, clothes? Well, like right here is like cut to there and it's just like... I need to get a good look at her again. Now you do, now that I've told you her secrets. <laughs> no, See? I... Like that's all netting. There's nothing underneath it. How Those can you tell? Bosoms. It's just... The half her clothes are almost her skin tone anyway. What if that's just the same color underneath? 
As you wish, then. Champions of Red Cliff. Oh man, drumstick champions. Thank you, Your Grace. Sweet. Do you know what I mean by drumstick <clears throat> champions? No. Oh my God. What? At the longest time, I thought they at the back of his shield. Um. Sorry, one second. Let me just get through this. Uh. Must surrender. I will spread. Yeah, spread the word of Logan Stretcher. So right there. Oh my God, it does. <laughs> okay, that's okay. Um. Yeah, sorry for the noise, but... Yeah, I, where, where the <coughs> fuck is it? Uh, okay, Alistair's king he doesn't want to be. Uh, I say proceed with the plan. Hell yeah, dude. God damn it, dude. Turn around. Okay, stop, stop, stop. Fuck. <laughs> uh, he's cooperated willingly. Damn him with faint prey. Then there is nothing more to say. Kill him. Oh, what? No. Oh, okay, well... In the mean he's, he's dead. I, I, I could have probably made another choice that made him live. But at the same time, look at this fucking drumstick. Alright, so at the very end, if, if you look at the fucking thing, it looks like that's a bone, and that's like a big old pile of meat ascending from a white shield-esque thing. Yeah. And whenever I pulled out my shield, I was like, I'm the drumstick champion, <laughs> because I used to wield a sword and a shield in a different playthrough. But it just looks like the yeah. fact that it's just a giant meaty chicken thigh. <laughs> um. The meat <laughs> part also kind of looks like a meatball. Yeah, so when I was a dwarf... I was the uh, the uh, drumstick champion. Uh, oh man, I can get, I can unite the dwarves now, right? Does it matter if who you... I unite in which order? No. Oh sweet. Okay. Dwarven kingdom. You wanna you wanna go? So what what is left? Uh, there's the dwarves. There's the elves. Yes. Yeah. Oh, I should do the elves. Too. Um. I don't remember. Well, we have them. to do them well, anyway. I don't. I just I'm wondering what to do next. I just don't remember like who does like the things like like what. And then, what yeah. else is there? Okay, I'm gonna go... And then there's, like, some DLC as well. Okay, I'm gonna go sell a bunch of shit. <laughs> and then... We're gonna be back. I'm gonna have a free inventory. I'm gonna do all the upgrading people's equipments. Oh, oh shit. Talk about what okay. At Redcliffe. Yes? I thought it, <laughs> think it turned out quite well. Nobody died. So much Sorry, Hell I'm yeah. Distracted. You're right. Good. I love you. Now that the warm, fuzzy part of the day is over with... <laughs> That's it? Puts back on his helmet. Alright. Eventually we're back gonna to have to do all the social shit. You do that off camera. Well... Yeah. Maybe. Um, but yeah, for the most I don't know if anybody's book. watching this to care about that. Fuck no. And also I don't. So... Alright, thanks for the run down the place. Hey, thank you. Bye. Oh, I just make that more legible as time goes on. <laughs> yeah, right? I'm a boy.